you don't want to mix a full mag and a, and a quarter mag. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So if you've only got one and a gun, then you can put it back in there. But it's a bad habit. It's better to just put it in your pocket. That way you know you've got some bullets, but you, you're not counting on it being full, right? Mm -hmm. All right. So what do we do? We come up against three bad guys. Three bad guys, one good guy. They all have guns, and I have a gun, and the gunfight's going to be on. Best way for me to survive that, if I turn around and run and they want to kill me, I'm a dead man, right? Unless they're all terrible shots. So the only thing I can do is fight. And I want them to not be able to strike me while I'm striking them, which brings in that we're going to be moving. And we have to be moving fast, not slow. I see people talk about shooting on the move and they're just creeping along. That doesn't do anything. People are going to address you just as quickly. You have to move quickly and address those assailants. And you're going to double tap, right? We want to at least double tap, but we don't double tap along the line. We want to put a bullet in everybody as quick as we can. So bullet, bullet, double tap, bullet, bullet. Then we address anybody that's left that we have to engage. So you go to the gun and you go to work. That's how you got to do it. One bullet in each target, double tap the third, and then put that extra bullet into the other two targets so you're double tapping everybody. And keep moving or at least get low when you have to address because you want to make yourself a smaller target. Keep safe. Keep safe.